need to do that we can come closer and closer to mukti? What is it that you and I can do to come closer and closer to mukti? I'm not telling you today, I'll tell you another day, but today I'm not telling you to go study Sanskrit. I'm not telling you to memorize one entire Ved. I'm not telling you to go to India and sit in a Gurukul. I'm not telling you things that, out, that may be outside of your grasp. I'm telling you and myself things that are within our daily grasp. When you get up in the morning, after, you, after you, you have learned how to speak sweetly, understand the need not to have fancy, expensive clothing, but to have whatever it is, clean clothing, that will, that will impact your mind when you wear clean clothing on the outside. It impacts the tone of cleanliness on the outside. When you scrape your dead cells and, and the body dirt that you have. And let me tell you, every minute of the day, look, our son Paul is here, and he, he's a scientist along those lines. Every part of your body gives out dirt. Even the cells, when they breathe, they give out dirt. The eyes in the morning, you, you clean your eyes night time. And you wake up in the morning, there is dirt. Your body sheds cells. That is dirt. When the body refuses to shed its dead cells, they say you're suffering from psoriasis. And your body begins to look dirty. You don't cut your nails, they gather dirt. Your body gives out and gathers dirt every morning, if not every afternoon, but preferably at least every morning. Oh, wash your body. It impacts on the, the cleanliness of your mind. And not only that, sadasthan karashodhana kije. Keep your home clean. Perhaps in this regard, I'm not the very best preacher, but the, 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 the writings are saying, keep your home clean. Never allow dirt to accumulate. You know why? Because again, cleanliness in outside impacts on cleanliness inside. When we are clean outside and inside, we then become healthy and strong in intellect. Our intellect, the home of our decisions, begins to make such decisions as would reflect that cleanliness. Uh, there are some people who are emotionally and psychologically sick and they clean the whole day. Anything to the extreme is bad. And so Rishi Dhyanand is saying, Shuddhi itni ki jiye Are tan nirmal ho jaan Chetana ho chetani Tanu dur gandhi na shaan <laughs> Would you read the blue for me? But cleanliness, let me hear loud and clear. But cleanliness must not be an obsession. Strive for that much cleanliness that will ensure a clean body and a clean and, and also a clean body that can impact on a clean mind and on a clean intellect. I know people who wipe the whole day. Ah, oh, they spend their time wiping the whole day. If anybody comes to their house, wherever they come and they sit and they stand, when you leave, they will clean that. That's an obsession. That's a sickness. We don't need that much. Anything, anything, anything to the extreme is bad. Look for the middle road. Chuddhi itni ki jiye tana niramal ho jai Strive for that much cleanliness that will ensure a clean body and a clean surrounding. Chaitana ho chittame. And, 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 and ensure that the cleanliness outside can ensure clean thoughts. Tanu durgandhi nashai. And the sum total of, of, of durgand and dirt in your body might all be, might all be washed away. Chant, the, chant this for me. Shuddhi itni ki jiye tan nirmal ho jaan Chetana ho chetani tan durgandhi na shaan Tan durgandhi na shaan Tan durgandhi na shaan Uh, 
बंदे मन के गंदे चल निश फल सांस तुम्हारे दिन तो कटे धन की धुन में और नींद में रात उजारे बंदे मन के गंदे बंदे मन के गंदे चल निश फल सांस तुम्हारे दिन तो कटे धन की धुन में और नींद में रात गुजारे Ha 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 ha. Oh, people with dirty minds. You and I, when we have dirt in our mind, we live for no purpose. When there is dirt in our mind that interferes with our moral decisions being taken, we spend our days gathering scrap iron wealth, and we spend the nights sleeping until one day we get a heart attack and we die. We never value anything else in life. Are na 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 she me chure re. Very nice. Pag sat sang se dur rahe. Haath kare na daan kabi. Kaan sune nahi jaan kabi. Ha haath kare na daan kabi. Kaan sune nahi jaan kabi. धर्म कर्म व्यवहार नहीं मन में दया उपकार नहीं जिहवा मधुर वचन नहीं बोल करुआ बहुत चारे बंदे मन के कैन यू रीड द ब्लू फॉर मी इफ यू रीड इट फॉर मी यू विल सेव मी फ्रॉम हैविंग टू एक्सप्लेन इट वुड यू रीड योर आईज लाउड एंड क्लियर Your eyes lust for intoxicating sight. Aha. Uh -huh. Your feet stay away from satsang. Aha. Uh -huh. Your hands give no charity. Aha. Uh -huh. And your ears hear not for words, words of wisdom. Aha. Uh -huh. Your behavior reflects no righteousness. Aha. Uh -huh. Your mind has no compassion for anyone. Aha. Uh -huh. And your tongue speaks very harsh words. धन दौलत जो पास तेरे नौकर चाकर दास तेरे बहुत है कारोबार तेरा इतना बड़ा परिवार तेरा बिल्डिंग और मकान सभी बाग बगीचे शान सभी एक दिन छोड़ के सब जाना है दोनों हाथ पसारे बंदे रीड फॉर मी लेट मी हियर योर वॉइस अ लिटल लाउडर दोज ऑन द इंटरनेट वॉन्ट टू हियर योर लवली वॉइस बिगिन एंड यू ऑन द इंटरनेट यू रीड टू बिगिन यू हैव You have wealth and, and servants. Uh huh. Your business exceeds limits. Uh huh. And your family is huge. This is for all the the, the capitalists. This might not uh, apply to us. Perhaps in a little measure. Continue. You even you even own, own many, many buildings, buildings and gardens. Ah. Uh -huh. But, But remember, remember, one day you will die, die and, and leave, leave the world. How? Empty-handed. Don't know, Auntie Betty, Mata Ji. You always preach this. Don't know how to pasare. Pasare means you stretch out your two hands like that. You fall down. Nadi bank book goes there. Nadi will goes there. Nadi deeds go there. Not the whatever you have go there. Even your dharam patni let go of your hand fast because this body will now be burnt in the cremational flames. But remember. One day you will die, and I'm sorry, uh, but some some people say, "Babai Satish, why do you talk about death?" And I say, "Well, why is there death? If I don't talk about it, fine. You don't want me to talk about it. How about it happening? And it happening without me and you being aware that death is coming. It is all."